What's up everybody, it's CMP with Craftmaster Productions and Studio12Tutorials.com Don't forget to stop by Studio12Tutorials, pick up your premium membership, it is 50 cents a day Also please don't forget to stop by CMPKits.com Get the new arrangement arsenal template, get the new Dark Chords product and get trap chords for scalar volume three also if you guys are interested in vintage samples and how to get a more vintage vibe out of your doll stop by studio one tutorials forward slash vintage for a free ebook it also comes with seven sample maker presets taken directly from uh, famous and prosperous sound ma sample makers that I know you guys um, admire and look up to um, so yeah go ahead and check that out now today we're going to be looking at how to use arrangement arsenal uh, particularly the file get it in blood right so since arrangement arsenal 2 and with the help of customer feedback, I've chosen to use the dot song format in order to uh, deliver these. This gives us the opportunity to open up the files in later versions of Studio One. Now, in order to use these, you have two options, right? You can either open the dot song file and do your work inside there, save it as a new name, and then and then be off. That's fine. But what I personally like to do is I like to open up the dot song file and then um, have a another session open because i don't know if you guys know this or not studio one you can have multiple songs open right now after i have both of these sessions opened up i will highlight and copy the regions from the event template and then paste those into the brand new session now i have all the info that i need to just go ahead and knock this song out so the next thing that I do is I'll do a quick scan of the regions to find out like what kind of drums or what type of instruments that I'm going to need. For this particular template, we use a guitar one shot and a piano melody. Now at this point, you can decide to either use the same instruments in the song and make, you know, something like a tight beat, or you can say, okay, I know that this is the makeup of the song that I want to use the arrangement of, but I'm going to add my own creativity to this and just use whatever instruments I want right for this for the purpose of this video i'm going to use the similar sounds right so first i found a guitar one shot <laughs> laid it out in the arrange window added some delay and the plate reverb. Next, let's add the piano melody. And we'll add some bass notes. Put on a simple top line. And what I want to do is I'm just going to adjust the pitch of this part. The guitar one shot is in B and B is pretty low for 808s. So let's pitch it up to around E. Yeah, it's much better. Now let's program some drums.
duplicate the pattern out. Delete the 808s where the template shows us. And we're done. By the way, if you guys want the MIDI for this lesson, it's available for all members of Studio One Tutorials. It's in the YouTube lesson MIDI files folder in the members exclusive Dropbox, along with all of the MIDI for all of our exclusive content. And with that, I'd like to tell you guys to keep it simple. Don't be basic. Stop by CMP Kits. Get yourself a copy of Arrangement Arsenal 6, and we will see you on the next one.